The Rising of the Unholy Three, page 266 from the Little Book of Revelation, received by William Alexander Brooks. More details in the description. I'll begin. The beast from the sea, even he whose name is translated into English from Hebrew, lightning fall from heaven, study to learn. For he does not desire women, nor regard any god, for he shall magnify himself above all. The dragon, beast from the sea, and beast from the earth will rise from the ashes as heroes for destroying secret Babylon, the great harlot, and they all work in collusion. They hate America and anything associated with the name of Jesus Christ, but they will bow the knee just the same in their judgment, from which they will never recover. So scripture cannot be understood in the current configuration of nations and the earth itself. For Yahweh is preparing to bring great shaking on the earth in judgment and borders will be redrawn. This is their final war to destroy the old order and bring Satan, bring in Satan's order, who will rule mankind via the beast from the sea and beast from the earth, who is also the false prophet. Ten horns, who are ten kings who will receive power to rule for one hour, for so it is given, will give their power and consent to this beastly trio. Behold, I will give you a basic order of events, so you will know the times you live. Some of these events happen in succession, and some happen simultaneously, and they are as follows. Mystery Babylon is destroyed as world war breaks across the earth, and even now they are st staging their militaries and are planning a very well-coordinated attack on Mystery Babylon. Do not believe your leaders, nor the media, for they are a pulpit of liars who are part of the attack. The beast from the sea and the beast from the earth and the dragon will rise from the ashes of war. These two evil beasts will stand in opposition to the two witnesses who will prophesy for 42 months, at which time they will be killed and will ascend into the heavens in three and a half days, and so their resurrection will be. As the temple is built, war on the saints continues 42 months, and the mark of the beast is established, administered, and enforced under pain of death. Then the turning point, when the abomination of desolation is carried out, and the beast from the earth will seek to kill all who would come to me, even Yeshua HaMashiach during this time. The beast from the earth declares himself God and turns against the people to kill them. He betrays the people in similar fashion as Antiochus Epiphanes. And I looked and lo a lamb stood on the Mount Zion and with him a hundred and forty four thousand having his father's name written in their foreheads. Blessed are the dead which die in the Lord. From henceforth, yea, saith the Spirit, that they may rest from their labors, and their works do follow them. And that concludes the message. I hope you all have a blessed day.